This is your host, Quasar Raspel, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. In the last episode, we beat a tournament at Olympus Coliseum, and I believe we went back to Traverse Town for a quick pit stop to show off what synthesis is. Synthesis is... okay. And I changed the equipment of my party. I equipped the Three Wishes Keyblade, increasing my strength from one... increasing my strength by one. And as well as gave Donald and Goofy different accessories. Now we're in Monstro. Yeah, swallowed by a whale. What a wonderful day. And we're supposed to go deeper into the stomach of Monstro. Monstro or not exactly the stomach, just wherever we are. What are you doing? Come on, let's go back. You know, Geppetto's awfully worried about you. Pinocchio, stop fooling around. This is no time for games. But Sora, I thought you liked games. Or are you too cool to play them now that you have the Keyblade? Riku? What are you doing That's here? That's a good question. Just playing with Pinocchio. You know what I mean. What about Kairi? Did you find her? Maybe. Catch us, and maybe I'll tell you what I know. Come on! I love that that's the reasoning for all this. Riku sees us, and instead of actually trying to get away from us, if he's actually trying to get away from us, but instead he wants to play a game with us, and... I'm just confused! I think I'm rightfully confused, and I believe I'm introducing a new enemy, one that I actually don't know. I believe it's called a Search Ghost, but I could be wrong. Again, I will have Watermelon text correct me if I make a mistake, which I bet I have been doing often. No, actually, I think I've been pretty good. I know this game pretty well, at least. But, with that level up, I didn't even know it, but we got ourselves Air Combo Plus, so now I do an additional hit while I'm in the air. Kind of straightforward, and just like Combo Plus adds hits to when I'm on the ground. So, one, two, three, four. I didn't hit him with the last one, but as you see, it's extended. Come on, you shadow! I'm not even strong enough to take out shadows. Oh. Can I just comment on something for a quick second? Well, commentary is kind of my job right now, isn't it? But look at this place! The colors! You know, I've said it before. I love it when games are colorful. It, it makes such a nice, well, atmosphere. This is the inside of a whale. These twitching yellow, green, and pink, and blue. I think this has to be the most diseased, infected whale on the face of the earth. Can I push this? I've never actually checked if I could before. I'm gonna go with no, but then again, why is it here? You can't even break it. I thought you could push it and like jump up to get up on the higher platform, but I'm confused. Anyway, the inside of Monstro is a giant, is a gigantic maze. No idea digestive tracks work like that. The big thing is that you don't want to fall off, so I'm gonna have to keep on moving and not risk it. Nothing really bad happens if you fall off, it's just you're gonna have to restart. And I also believe this is an introduction of a new enemy that I just passed called the Barrel Spider. And Barrel Spiders are just like those pot spiders at Agrabah. But there is a significant difference, though. You see, where pot spiders just ran around and attacked you, getting in your way and being all annoying, they weren't much of a threat. Barrel spiders, on the other hand, well, those things do the, do the terrible thing of blowing up. So, yeah. It's not really so Wow, my magic is strong. And I believe we're trying to head to Chamber 4, but this place is so convoluted it's hard to tell which way is up. And there's a Barrel Spider. 
Now, even though it shows the blowing up animation... <laughs> okay, that one's not a spider. Even though it shows up the blowing up animation, uh, it only hurts you if they do it themselves. I love the drive. I've said that before, but I can't get enough of it. Now, I'm sorry if I make, uh, I'm sorry if I'm not taking the fastest route throughout Monstro. I honestly don't know it. I don't know Monstro as well as I should have, and I don't know all the collectibles in the area. This is a place, if I'm going to collect everything, I'm going to have to come back to. So let's try hitting Chamber 5. And I believe we have to go across this walkway and Chamber 4! I made it! Yes! Why do you still care about that boy? He has all but deserted you for the Keyblade and his new companions, after all. I don't care about him. I was just messing with him a little. Oh, really? Of course you were. Beware the darkness in your heart. The heartless prey upon you. Mind your own business. I love how Maleficent can be the most cool-looking person in this place and maintain her cool being inside of a frickin' whale. And how was Pinocchio running right there? Wasn't... Riku. Wasn't Riku holding him? What's the matter with you? What are you thinking? Don't you realize what you're doing? What is he doing? I was about to ask you the same thing, Sora. You only seem interested in running around and showing off that Keyblade these days. Do you even want to save Kairi? I do. Well, I guess we should save the wooden puppet. Hey, a save point. Too bad I'm not going to be using it right now. We gotta... We gotta go into the bowels. I wish I knew more of a, the digestive track. And hello there. You up for this? No problem. Let's do it. <laughs> All right then. And now, taking on a boss, Parasite Cage. So we're taking on a parasite inside a monstro. Wonderful. This is actually one of the most one of the most awkward changes they did from the original game. I'll show a I'll throw up a picture here about what a uh, parasite cage originally looked like. Oh my god, he's just so difficult to look at. He contrasts with the background so much. <laughs> He's just so... I want to say flamboyant, but... That doesn't seem to fit, fit what he is. Plus, I can never tell if he, this is actually like... How many Heartless this actually is. Because it looks like... Uh, he's got a face up top. Don't know why I healed there. Why am I not... Fire? Probably because it does less to bosses than it does to enemies. That's why I never use magic too much. I mean, I get why magic is good and all that. I mean, it's a ranged attack. Who doesn't love staying back and not getting hurt? And again, I do have MP haste now, so... Die, 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 die! I actually killed a boss with magic! And I chose the staff! It's a miracle! <laughs> Do you even know where that goes? Goofy Learn Cheer. Seriously, you could be heading into a terrible part. Also, how is the whale actually breathing in space? I mean, there's no oxygen if we're near the lungs. I have no retrospect of actually where we are inside of a whale. I 
and just like that, the water sank a bit. Pinocchio! Pinocchio! Please, give me back my son! Sorry, old man. I have some unfinished business with this puppet. He's no puppet. Pinocchio is my little boy. He is unusual. Not many puppets have hearts. I'm not sure. But maybe he can help someone who's lost theirs. Wait a minute. Are you talking about Kyrie? What do you care about her? Hmm. That's kind of a jerk move not to include us. So, question about whale anatomy. Where are the bowels located? Because right now we're in the mouth. And we dropped down. And there's the spine. How did we get back here? Are the bowels located above the spine of a whale? Oh, this hurts my head too much. So, first things first though, brilliant chest right here. And a chest gives us the ability, high jump. Which is quite astounding that a chest could somehow teach you how to jump higher. Anyway, in the shared section, we have this. I jump. Now, every single one of us can jump higher, and Sora now does front flips as well. Very useful ability. Honestly, I could not imagine playing this game without it. Besides the beginning portions, I mean, you know that. Up, jump up, and Trandy Mark here. Come on. Come on, Donald, grab it! Why did you push it? Darn you, Donald! Now we get ourselves a Mithril Shard. So yeah, this place, you actually do have to repeat a lot of things because you now have high jump. Let's also explore a bit of this area. We get ourselves a Scan G, if, for those of you who like messing with the gummy ship. Jump up higher, jump up, and in this treasure chest we get a cottage! Something I might use because I found out that they're actually more useful than I thought in previous games. By that I mean I've used one this game. Jump up here, and we get Water Gleam. That's a curious item. Well, we'll investigate that later. So for now, let's head on over here. Darn hitting my head. Tap that. And we get three Dalmatians. Alright, that seems like a good place to leave off. Next time, we're going to have to enter that top door to follow after Riku and Pinocchio. Next time on Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, we're going to be doing just that. This has been your host, Quasar Raspel, signing out.